welcome back to my channel this is Casa Nyla tips you are very welcome if you're just stopping by for the first time or you're just seeing my channel for the first time click on that subscribe button below that says subscribe and subscribe to my channel and turn on your notification bell to be updated whenever there's a video coming from me okay guys please subscribe please support me mm, i am begging you all please so today guys i'm going to be showing you how to make your whitening shower gel in a black soap form yeah in a black soap form so in my last video i uploaded i said i was going to post this video and i made my whitening black soap the liquid one so i thought i was going to post it so now i'm going to show you how i made it so okay before then guys i am going to apologize for something that happened on my last video so many people were complaining some of my subscribers my friends were complaining about the video i am so sorry i didn't edit that video i didn't use filter for that video i didn't use anything like filter no i am so sorry my camera was bad my phone camera then was bad and the sun ray from my window was so much and i didn't even notice it i thought i didn't i didn't notice it at all i am so sorry for the inconvenience i am really really sorry if you guys didn't complain about it if my friends didn't complain and my subscribers my everybody didn't complain i wouldn't have even know so now i know it because my camera then was below i am so so sorry i have a new phone now so i am filming without any stress this is my bare face I'm not hiding my face. This is how I look. This is my face. This is my real face. <laughs> okay, guys, I am so sorry for that video. So, guys, I'm sorry. Beside that, mm, this is black soap. <laughs> you see the way I'm happy about this black soap? Like this black soap. Hmm, I call this soap my Osha Pra Pra Whitening Shower Gel. This soap is good and this soap is amazing. This is the soap I've been using for months and guys i can tell you huh, this soap is good look at my skin now it's it glows your skin it gives you that shining look it it will just glow your skin that this glow that you have from this soap this soap is amazing so guys i am going to show you how to make the soap and if you know you can't get all the ingredients i use on this soap please just comment below and i will show you something else you can use to substitute a particular ingredients you can't get but these ingredients are very easy to get you can go to your lo normal local market and you can get this ingredient from your local market if you want to get these ingredients in a very easy manner you can get it from there's these people that sell um that's i don't know if it's a yoruba line in the market you can get to a yoruba market and you will see most of these ingredients they are very very easy to get guys so without too much talk let me take you to my workstation and let me show you how i come up with this sweet amazing soap you will come back and thank me later because if you make the soap you will love it so guys let's go to my workstation and work it out don't forget to subscribe thank you guys so guys this is my workstation and this is the black soap i'll be needing this is my black soap i just use my hand to crush them so you can use anything to crush them so i'll be needing some tablet soap okay so this is i'll be using k brother Look at it. I don't know if you can see it. I'll be using K Brother soap, the carrot soap. I will grate them. I'll be using my bleaching glutathione and vitamin C and E Koji Acid Plus whitening program soap. I'll be using my Dudu Ocean because though Dudu Ocean and black soap are almost the same, I all add they are the same, but I love adding my Dudu Ocean to this whitening shower gel because it gives it a whole it take it gives it a whole new scent and it takes it to a whole new level so i'm going to grate all this black soap now and I'll, all this um sorry i'm going to grate all this tablet soap and i'm back guys i'm done grating my soap these are the soap i grated this is the doodoo -doo ocean this is the k brother this is the k brother the one with this orange color and this is the other glutathione soap the one with the ashes color okay this is it so now guys i'm going to be adding this soap to my black soap and i'll pour hot water when i mean hot water extremely hot water boiling hot water into it and leave it for like three to four hours for it to dissolve before i introduce you to my other ingredients okay i'll add it so guys this is it i've added it so i'm not going to bring my hot water and add it to it for it to dissolve so guys, here's my hot water. I've added some before and I'm going to add more. 
So it all depends on your quantity of soup and how you want it to be watery. You can decide to add more hot water, but this is enough for me. Now I'm going to cover it and allow it to dissolve and I'll come back and check it and introduce you to my other ingredients, okay? Guys, this is what I got from the soup after leaving it to melt with the hot water for two hours plus this is what i get so you can leave yours to mend more than this or you can actually leave yours to stay more than the two hours but you can still see some particles that are still around so i'll still they will still mend by themselves okay this is my black soap shower gel mixed with my other um tablet soaps and guys what i'm going to be adding now is i'm going to be adding my other ingredients the first ingredient i'm going to be adding now is my thyme cooking time this is the time so it's not like we just use this one to cook alone you can use it for your skin it's very very good it will help your skin to firm your skin and you know it's a the time is like is, is an herb so it's going to help your skin a lot i'll be adding all of this into my soup this is it guys time is very good for the skin it's an herb it's going to really help your skin glow to firm your skin tighten your pores as well and it will help your skin so this is it guys so after adding that i'll leave that to dissolve now i'm going to be adding my powder my whitening powder this is my citric acid powder i'm going to be adding just one um i'm going to be adding one teaspoon of my one and a half teaspoon of my citric powder I'll be adding two of it. I'll add one and I'll add two. So that's it, guys. I will allow that to dissolve by itself as well. See, it's dissolving now. See, it's, so I'll mix together and I'll allow it to dissolve. There is if this thing is still hot, so anything you add to it will dissolve on time. So don't be scared that it's, the thing is hot. That if I had my products, it's going to get uh, these uh, plums loves or whatever it's called this thing is still hot so it's going to mend everything right. the next ingredients i'm going to be adding is my baking soda this is my baking soda baking soda is very good for the skin it's going to help your skin a lot it's going to um whitening your skin it's going to help your skin a lot when i say help, it's really going to help your skin a lot so what i'm going to be doing is that i'm going to be mixing this baking soda in a bowl i will miss it is it i'll mix my baking soda with my rose water one tablespoon one and a half tablespoon look at the one and a half tablespoon add one and i'll add another i'm using two of that spoon so i'm going to mix it with my rose water you can use your coconut oil to mix it you can use your olive oil to mix it but i'll be mixing mine with my rose water look at it glycerin and rose water mix my rose water and my coconut oil I'll mix it both both i'll add just one this i'll add just one and a half teaspoon see of my rose water one look at it one so this is enough so guys we wash this soap very well this soap is really really amazing now i'm going to be adding my coconut oil i'll be adding just one of this i'll be adding just one of this yes that is it that's my coconut oil actually i placed it on a lylon because it was pouring off from the container so this is it i'll mix it together thoroughly now i will pour it inside my soup pour it into my shower gel guys this shower gel is really effective that is it guys now i'm going to stir it together i'll be adding my serum i'll be adding my gold skin serum I'll be adding just I'll be adding this one i'll be using this spoon i'll be adding three of it one two three this is enough so guys this is my shower gel you see that with time it's going to all this is going to turn to the total black it's, 
all this foam will be at the baking soda is trying to melt it will be at guys so don't be scared this is it guys see black soap to mint for time this shower gel is very good really really good that's it guys now i'm going to add my guys i'm going to be adding one pigment dough to my soap you can choose to skip this but i love pigment dough because it's whitening my skin give me an even skin tone okay guys just add one more pigment dough Mix it together. Guys, this is my gamma preservative. I'm going to be adding it since I want this soap shower gel to last for a long time. So that's it. And I'll mix together again. This is it, guys. This shower gel is going to whiten your skin. It's going to give you a glowing skin. It's going to clear all your blemishes and any skin problem that you have. This is it, guys. You see how thick it is if you want yours to be watery than this you can add more hot water or you had rose water it's going to really help see how thick it is guys so guys this is my shower gel i'm going to be pouring this into my container this is my container i'm going to be pouring it into my container and i'll show you how it looks like inside the container guys <laughs> this shower gel now oh guys oh guys this is the shower gel. this is how it looks like now when i pour it into my container so guys if you love this video please don't forget to give it a thumbs up subscribe and turn on your notification bell to be updated whenever i upload a new video guys see you on my next video bye bye